All right, everyone, it is the morning of, let's see, the Southern Showcase weekend. I'm for sure going to Deep South tonight, maybe not tomorrow. We'll have to see how the weather pans out, and tomorrow is also my birthday. So I would prefer to go, um, but uh, I don't know. We'll see. This bomber car here, I don't think they're racing. So I need to go to the junkyard and get a new PCM. I think that's kind of boiling down to our pinpoint spot for air. I was welding on the car with the battery in it, but I didn't have the terminal. I didn't have the negative terminal connected. And on the power, power terminal, we had the uh, master shutoff switch. It should have been fine, but welding on this car and with the harness that's all chopped up and just exposed wires, touching the roll bar you never know i think we probably fried something and it's all kind of pinpointing to this box right here so we got power leaving the fuse box going to places but we don't have power arriving at those places so and they all kind of go through uh this pcm so i think we might have fried it just from what we've been troubleshooting. If that doesn't work, we get one in and the car doesn't crank immediately up, then uh, I'm just gonna have to spend the off season cutting the harness down like I did for the Mod Light, kind of just putting everything on its own switch, the fuel pump on its own switch, uh, wiring up the ignition with the coil packs and the injectors all on one switch, and then having the starter on its own switch and kind of just getting rid of all the other crap. So I have six covers sitting here that I need to cut, sand, buff, and then get clear coated for tonight. Two are going to be given away tonight to, I believe, the last person on the lead lap, and then four on Saturday night. So I was trying my method a little bit different, and some of them came out really, really nice. Um, and others, maybe not so much. But hey, you're, if you're a last place car on the lead lap, you're getting free car fiber mud covers. Can't really complain. Uh, some had a little bit of air air pockets develop, uh, but I mean they're still usable. I would run them. I mean I'd run all the ones I'd mess up like this anyway. So, and uh, they've proven to still be durable. So I I test that on a weekly basis. All right, so that's what it looks like after I cut it out. You know the holes look like crap. The whole thing looks like crap. But right, the power of YouTube editing. I snap my fingers, this will be good. And boom, just like that, they're all done. Oh, I'm ready to take this mask off. I mean, look at that stuff. I don't know if it's safe to breathe in here, but, whew, that is terrible. All right, so I'm getting ready to load up. We have all of the covers here. Uh, I think maybe Billy Franklin might be having one of my GoPros on on his car tonight. And so I'm giving him a cover uh, as kind of like a thank you. So maybe y'all will be able to ride along in a super late model. All right, we're here. Uh, all right. Normally I see a bunch of people pitted right here. Maybe they got it blocked off or something. I don't know. Maybe everyone's just pitting out back there where we normally pit. We're still a little early. Gates don't open till three, technically, but oh well. Well, we made it. Wow. They are working it in. Wow. Beautiful out here. Let's go. Let's go walk around these pits.
came off his oil system and uh, he, uh, he's gonna call it a night, probably a weekend. I guess he's got two points races next weekend at Buckshot and Southern. So, congratulations. Sucks, but at least y'all got to ride along for hot laps and qualifying, but we're gonna watch these heat races. Matter, Jake? Should you be hey, out there right man, now? You see that car? I bet you his wiring harness doesn't look like spaghetti. <laughs> yeah, look at look what's in the back. There's a crown big. All right, here's your starting lineup for the Bomber Division car sitting on the front oh, row. Yeah. Car seven from Florella, Alabama. What Christian happened, dude? Carnley. This hurt. This Outside hurt your feelings. Of him will be the two car, Ronnie Harris out of Milton, Florida. A little bit. Inside oh, yeah. of row two, the one. Especially seeing another one of you out there. Oh yeah, yours looks ten times better. At least he's got chains on it. He's got a chain on his back bumper on like you. Let's see how he does. Oh, these are like snails at the super late models. Here we go. Let's see how this crown big. Hey, okay, great flag's gonna wave. Here we go. Six lap race here. got done talking to Bo Bell that's the driver of that Crown Vic and he was kind of steering us in a better direction of what to do with this harness I still don't know freaking know what's going on with this thing it is now he said it could be the security system we could have could have tripped that putting the batteries on and off and I I don't know we'll have to figure it out deep south it's actually been a day uh we got back really late that friday night didn't end up making a closeout video i was just kind of running around the pits talking to everyone meeting everyone getting some orders in for some carbon fiber stuff so i'm super swamped with that now thankfully but i'm getting ready to leave for a month uh for some training to do out in texas so it's kind of like a double-edged sword like i wanted more business but now i'm like i'm also leaving so um, but anyways, I had a great time out there. Very well organized event. I was going to go back Saturday because yesterday was my birthday. Watch Saturday night, but they ended up rain delaying it till today, Sunday. I'm not able to make it out there. I got a lot of stuff I had to do, uh, unfortunately, but I hope y'all have a great time if y'all are there. If not, I'll be watching it on flow right here in the shop as I'm getting work done out here. Um, but anyways, I want to give a quick shout out to, uh, the Presley Fabrication. They got these... 3d printed carb caps um, you can put your spark plugs in there these are pretty nice this is the five inch uh, because we have the longer all thread um, for us late model guys I guess but these are pretty dope we talk to the guy with that crown Vic about some stuff uh, we're gonna wait on this PCM to get in I, I, I don't know this thing is a freaking nightmare <laughs> I mean it is an absolute nightmare. 
So look forward to some future videos with this guy, see what we end up doing with it and what we find the problem out to be. Don't really have time to troubleshoot it today. Don't really want to spend my time troubleshooting it today. Uh, got some work to do on the late model. I'm going to get a couple sheets of flat black. We're going to redo the decking this off season. I've already got my right side body panels. I'm using those stacked body panels, those plastic ones. We'll redo a nose and uh, the other side. And I might make a roof out of carbon fiber. I don't know. We'll have to see how that goes. But anyways, fellas, if you made it this far, I really appreciate you watching and sticking with this whole video. Uh, we will see y'all in the next one.